Hello and welcome back to Desert DIY. If you are new here, my name is Corey. Today I'm going to be taking this old window screen that I had in my garden as a trellis and I'm going to be turning it into a gigantic canvas wall art. As you can see up close, this thing was pretty trashed, but it was still structurally sound, so I thought it would make a really good backing for a canvas. Here is the fabric that I bought. I bought it from Joann's Fabric and I spent about $19 on it. I think it was around $19.50, so just under $20. If I were to try and buy wall art the size of this window screen, it would be easily around $200, maybe $150, buying it from just a regular home decor store. This thing was as tall as me, so imagine that trying to buy it in a store. <laughs> Very expensive. So the amount of fabric I used was about two yards and I just guessed at the store and it ended up just barely being enough to fit on the screen which I thought was just faked. And I am using a regular T50 staple gun. I'm not a huge fan of this staple gun because I have pretty weak hands and I really really want to upgrade to an electric one pretty soon. I actually am going to be doing a whole upgrade to quite a few of my tools soon to be cordless electric ones so that way it's easier for me and it doesn't hurt my hands as much so the stapler will be one of them <laughs> all i did was pull tight and staple them when i staple the fabric to the sides i start in the middle and work my way out and right here i am cutting off the excess to staple the last side onto the frame here When doing the final side, when you're stapling it on, you're going to want to pull real tight so that way you get all the wrinkles out, there's not any kind of like weird loose areas, but you also want to make sure that you're not pulling so tight as to create puckers in the fabric. You want it to be nice and flat. And I ran out of staples here, so I'm just going to reload my staple gun. As I was going, I just folded over the corners to make a nice, crisp, flat corner. Looking back on this project, I'm actually thinking that it might be cool to put a border around this piece. A lot of these canvases in the stores are just canvas and they don't have a border, but I kind of think I want to add a border on here. What do you think? Let me know down in the comments below. What do you think like a dark blue border or a wood stained border would look like around this piece? The chicken wire backing on this piece made it so easy to hang and look at how beautiful it looks now that it's done. It really does look like a painting and that is almost solely because of the fact that the fabric I picked looked hand painted and I couldn't be any happier with it unless it had a border of course. But thank you so much for watching. If you liked what you saw today don't forget to hit like and subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye!